All right, guys, welcome back to Full Circle with Joyce. Time now for us to dive into our fitness segment, and we're here with Skola Mushiri. And uh, Karibu Tana to the show. Asante. How are you doing? I'm fine, thank you. Good. Today we're doing a water bottle workout. Yes, and uh, that is our props. Okay. So I hope guys are ready. Yes. yes. Tell us what this can actually do and what this can actually imitate in the house. So the water bottles are, we are, we are trying to imitate resistive kind of training. Mm -hmm. So this is our resistance, okay? Mm -hmm. This is our weight. So it can be your dumbbell, it can be your bar. This is anything that has weight. Okay. Now I have my intermediate and I have my beginner. Okay. Now if they are heavy for you, you see the sizes, uh, they vary. Right. This 500 ml, this is a liter, and you can also use the 1.5. Right. If they are still heavy for the 500, you just pour out the water and you use empty bottles. Okay. Yes. All right. Well, take it away. And remember, guys, uh, at the end of this, I'm going to be announcing the winners of our book giveaway. So you want to keep sending in your SMS. It's a double two triple nine. And we'll see you shortly. Sawa, sawa. Thank you. Um, Score Fitness here with Tim. Uh, remember, it's hey, hey, keep moving. You have to keep moving. Sawa. Every time before we start, we have to warm up. Sour. All right, so arms out and we roll. We're going to do a lot of um, shoulders. We're going to do core. We're going to do legs. Sour. Um, so let's get ready. Breathe in. Breathe out. I hope you're ready with us. Sour. If you're not, just can be up a kitchen or anywhere in your store. Change sides. And then you grab some, some water bottles. Sour. All right. All right, let's do high knees. You pick up and you lift. See, for warming up, there's, not, there's no really coordination or any form that you have to follow. It's just getting your heart rate from resting to a point where you can actually get moving sour. Just keep going. These bottles are blocking my move. Remember, you have to have a lot of space. You have to have enough for you to move, okay? Eight. Last one. Okay. Now we go down and reach all the way up and slightly extend. Let's go down and up. Remember, you want to be warmed up fully, not half. All right, so your heart rate ought to be going up. That's okay. Panting is good. We've been talking about this. Panting is good. It says that you're ready for the next workout. Two more. Last one. Okay, and we jog on the spot. Let's jog. We pick it up. We take it out. All right, remember, short burst workouts. If you don't do them right, they will not give you any significant change. So, so you have to really be intentional with your 10 minutes, with your 15 minutes, with your 20 minutes, all right? They don't give the same effect as 30 minutes workout or one hour workouts, okay? So you have to be intentional, I will repeat. And you have to move, okay? So you have to know why you're moving. Are you moving to just be physically fit or do you want to burn that extra fat or get that extra muscle, okay? So you have to know so that you also know your method of training. But this year today, this will get you sorted on everything in five, four, three, two, and drop, breathe in. Two more, last one, and we are ready. All right, we pick our props. All right, so we're ready. They're jogging on the spot. We're gonna be doing something called active stretch. So at no point are you standing still, you're just moving, all right? So this is my intermediate and this is my advance so the first workout lunge and bicep curl and we alternate all right three two one let's go nice go that's one all right remember you can even use the workout that you have to even warm up okay that's three keep going don't be worried about punting i told you it's a good thing that's four don't extend too much. That's five, halfway. Don't extend too much on the lunge. All right, six. And make sure your knee doesn't touch the ground. Seven, keep going. Breathe in, breathe out. Maintain straight posture. What do I mean? Straight back. One more. Last one. All right, we're back to our active stretch as a demo the next. All right, the next is a T. We're doing a T with the shoulders, okay? this this and out okay three two one let's go don't let go of your props now for the arms okay it doesn't matter the routine that you follow sour you just follow any routine or rather you form the t however you want clockwise or anti-clockwise as long as you're moving all right three more two more last one 
All right, we're back to our active stretch now. We are combining workout one and workout two. We will lunge and then we do a T. In three, two, one, let's go. Let's lunge, bicep curl, let's form a T. Boom, nice. Let's lunge the other leg, curl. Let's go. That's two, let's go. Now you're in there, T. That's three, go, go. That's four, keep going. All right, go, that's five. I wanna watch on how, keep going, that's six. So when you lunge, you're at 90 degrees. Forward leg, back leg, 90 degrees. That's seven, keep going. Make sure your hands don't go too high up and they don't go too down low. Two more, keep going. Lunge, up, give me the T. All right, one more, lunge, back, give me the T. And we are back, our active stretch. Let's go, active, active stretch is good. Especially when you have short burst workouts, okay? You don't have that much time to keep taking one minute, two minutes out. So you keep actively resting. That's what it means. So you are resting, but you are active. You're not on the spot just standing still. Again, you don't want your heart rate to go down. You want to keep your heart rate going up and up. Because the more it goes, the more you're burning, more the more you're doing more workout, all right? So as they jog, I demonstrate the next workout, all right? So we're here. We will do a row. We're still using our prop and roll. So all we're doing is the roll, all right? <sighs> breathe in, breathe out, three, two, one. Let's go down. Remember, if you're advanced, you're here. If you're a beginner, you're on your knees, all right? All right, let's go, roll, and roll. That's one, keep going, and roll. That's two, keep going, and roll. That's three. Are you seeing how she's rowing? That's four, okay? So you're not here, you're not rowing here. This is not helping you, that's five. You're here, you're fully extending, okay? All right, three more. Keep going, row and row. Last two, row and row and we come up. Don't forget your bottles. These are your props, all right? You're not leaving them. These are your dumbbells, this is your weight, all right? Next workout, we're doing jacks with the bottles, all right? So I'll demo. So it's front, side, front, and side, all right? So we move, we move, we move. Three, two, one, let's go. Up, side, go, up, that's one. Keep going, up, go, up, that's two. Up, go, up, that's three, keep going. That's four. Make sure you're breathing, don't hold your breath. That's five. Six. Three more. Eight. One more. And active rest. Our heart rates are up. Yeah, we're doing something. We didn't, we didn't come here to play. Just because it's 10 minutes, make them count. So, so we are combining workout one and workout two. So we draw and then we do front, side, and the side, that will be one, all right? Let's go down. Breathe in, breathe out, let's go, row. The other side, come up, and we go center, side, center, that's one. Let's go down. I know it's a problem for heavy people to get up. Let's go. So don't worry about it. You get up, how? <laughs> Did I just say help? <laughs> you get up, <laughs> the only way you know how to get <laughs> up, okay? That's three. Keep going, keep going. Let's make this count. All right, go, go. That's four, we are in there. It's not stopping now. Let me demo how you might struggle coming up. If you come up like this, don't worry about it. That's where you are, okay? It doesn't matter, I'll do it again. If this is where you are, while you're struggling to come up, that's where you are. The goal is to start from where you are and then you pick it up. I mean, you can't be coming up in a Madhogothanio kind of way and do it for forever. You have to be growing. If there's no growth, there's no point. Sour. All right, up. We have one last. Okay, let's go, row. When you're rowing, avoid swinging your body side to side. Okay, active rest. 
At this point, if you want to place your weights down, rest. It's allowed, you're not a robot. So you just rest, breathe in, breathe out. We're moving to the next workout. We're not going down. Why? Our heart rate is up. Okay, there's no point of going up and going down. Judy, are you good? Silly, yeah. are you good? Yeah. All right, let's go, let's go. My people are good. I hope your people, or rather yourself, you're good. I'll demo as a joke. Next workout, we are here. Okay? We're not dropping our props. Three, two, one. Give me 10 counts. Go. One. Nice. Two. Go. Three. Every time you go down, you bend your knees. Five more. Seven. Eight. Nine. One more. Let's jog. Let's jog. Let's jog. All right. As you're jogging, I'm giving you the next move. Okay? Side. Then punch. Then side. Then punch. All right? We start to go down with the right. Three. Two. One. Let's go. Down. One. Now pick it up. Two. When you punch, punch with the core. Four. There you go. See? Let's go. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Two more. Nine. Jog. Let's go. We're changing sides. We're not waiting because we're in the zone. Let's go. We change sides. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Tap. One. Tap. Two. Tap. Three. Go. Four. Five. Six. Don't be left behind. Seven. Eight. Nine. And ten. Let's go. We're combining the two. So, I believe we all can get water, bo water bottles. If you don't have water, use them while they are empty. If you feel like you're stronger, get the 1.5 liter. So, use that. We are combining. Are you ready? Judy is breaking a sweat. <laughs> Means we're doing, we're doing something here. Sour. Let's go. So we're doing the squat and then we do one side with the one we started with. Let's go down and go up and go down. All right. Let's go down and two. Go. All right. Three. It's okay if you forget. Four. Keep going. Come on. Let's go. At the end of the day, you're moving. Halfway there. The goal is to move. You don't stop. You don't forget why you started. Three more. Down and up. And then again, you don't just move because people are moving. You move intentionally. You move with a purpose. Give me one last. One more. Tap. Tap. All right. Uh, you want to give a bonus? I see you. It's good. It's good sometimes when you want to give a bonus. I'm taking my props. We're going to the other side. We're still maintaining the squat jump. Okay? Three, two, one. Let's go. And up. Woo! And go. One. Go. Two. Oh, sorry. Hey, Judy. You want to be left behind? Three. Go. Four. Keep going. Five. Don't be afraid of not coordinating. Sour. Don't be afraid. Fitness should give you coordination. It should. There are things that come naturally when you when you become more fit. Sour. Mobility is one of them, especially if you're targeting that. One more. And coordination. All right. Ooh, we my people. Let's go. We are here. We're still jogging. We're jogging. We're jogging. We're jogging. Now we are combining all the workouts from the top. Ten counts. Okay. I will only give you five seconds to break. You at home. I'll only give you five seconds from one workout to the other workout. So ten counts. Let's see how far you can push. Are you ready? Five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. Start with the lunge. Who? One. Keep going. It's individual workout too. Whew. Three. Now at this time you pick it up. Four. Huh. Five. Make those noises. All right. Six. This is your time. Be yourself. Seven. Three more. Eight. Watch for your knees. Watch for your knees. You need your knees. If you break your knees, I won't give you mine. One more. You need your knees. I did a bonus? Okay. So, but I'm the trainer. Let's go. So we're moving to the shoulder. We're moving to the T's. Five, four, three, two. Let's go to the T's. Go. One. Sorry, Judy. Two. Now, if you're tired, three. And if you want to go on, four. So you just drop. 
and then you go five okay just keep going six seven at no point are you stopping eight two more one more all right let's jog we're moving we're moving next workout oh yes yeah. don't worry you've got this you're doing this for yourself now so you're good to go to the rows let's go the five seconds are over let's move now we're moving with the purpose one remember don't do this this is my dumbbell down below okay make sure you're straight that's two go three co balance okay four five we're moving now six seven if you're at home with us and you need to take a break nisawa take the five seconds break Whew. last one row and then row and we come up we're moving doing the sides eh so we're doing this and then that 10 counts 3 2 1 let's go tap one faster move 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 two move three move four five go six go seven eight two more nine one more all right the other side as we wrap this up three two one let's go and one and two move it three four go five go six seven eight nine jog on the spot we finish with the squat jumps okay are you ready jump like you want to tobo anisha uku ju you jump three two one let's go up one up six eight and ten we cool it down take our props down and we jog on the spot we are done all right well done guys thank you so much asante asante <laughs> <laughs> wow you know someone here texted in saying um hey joyce aki I'm, i can't stop laughing at my mom it's not that easy that's not nice <laughs> <laughs> Be encouraging your mom anyway at least the mom was working out at least you she guys. was moved with us yes absolutely well thank you very much scholar who knew you could get this sweaty with some water bottles yeah and it's just a right couple of your house yeah, it's just a couple of water bottles that are in your house they're just sitting idling like the paper bags right or the bags that we normally have right. so we get to use them and we get to move and get our, our physical going fantastic thank you for being here again how can people find you very quickly oh they can find me on instagram at @scofitness and the hashtag is hey hey keep moving all right yes. well thank you to you and the team and remember guys i did have a giveaway uh for you today and i've gotten so many sms's today i've been trying to sort through as many of them as i can uh very quickly some final ones to read for you here hey joy some carol from kambu my gift is cooking i can use my gift to feed the hungry you say and the author says it's one of the ways uh one of the ways is spending time working on your gift um i also have here anastasia from from Muchatha who's 20 years old and says I believe my gift is speaking more of counseling people which I'm looking forward to opening a rehab center especially for people battling drugs and similar addictions sooner and you say spending time with your gifts is one of the ways we can enhance the gift Another says my gift is service and for the past 2 years I have served in many ways from my family to every person I've met I'm thankful to God for my gift and one of the things that I have learned is that to develop my gift I need to build a vision around my gift this has been so validating and um you're hoping to win one of the books on offer all right guys i do have to choose winners thank you so much again we did call the author and he's offered to give us an extra book so i have two winners to award so the first one i'm going to hand it over to this one who texted in at 902 am saying hey joyce my gift is being a great makeup artist and i use it by making people feel good about themselves the author recommends increasing one's knowledge and also to spend 
more time working on the gift. Your number starts with 0708 and with 449. Congratulations. You win one of the books this morning. The other one that I'm going to award uh, came in at 916 a.m. And you say, good morning, Joyce. I think my gift is doing tech work, reading and sharing the word. I just found this out during quarantine, you say. And you say, I apply my gifts starting from my family and friends and most people who I come across. I help out mostly with tech work and I also share the word almost every day. I believe God gave me these gifts on purpose since I am a shy person and you can use the text, the tech to share the word. You say Dosa Redito says we should spend time with the gift and practice it. And uh, you just started out your virtual library and would like to add on to your physical one. Valerie from Nairobi, you also win yourself a copy of this book. Your number starts with 0790 and with 718. Congratulations to the winners today. If you didn't win one today, don't worry. Uh, let me know if you want us to do this some more and have more of these book reviews here on the show. But for now, Kwaheri Nisana, have yourselves a wonderful day. Let's meet here tomorrow for even more Full Circle with Joyce. Until then, ciao.